Hi there, you're watching this video because your bank and AccountRight are ready to talk. And that's a big hooray. But before you get AccountRight doing your dirty work, there's something you need to do. And there are some things to learn and to watch out for. So let's get you started. Setting up is easy. You just need to link your bank account with an AccountRight account. You can do this from the bank feeds window. This window is looking a little dull at the moment, but when you check for updates, you'll liven things up. As we're all about security, you need to enter your my.myob details. If your account write files online, these are the same details you use to log into your file. These details are needed each time you get a feed. You should now see the bank account that you've registered. Just select the account write account that you want to link your bank to, and you're done. Now, get your feed. You'll notice the number of transactions received from your bank. They start from the date your feed was turned on by your bank. With a first feed only, you'll need to watch out for transactions you've already selected for reconciliation. We'll talk about this a bit later. Let's get down to work. Your job is to make sure everything that your bank says happened is recorded in account right. Your bank transactions appear on the left. You'll need to add them to your records or match them to account right transactions, which appear on the right. A match is suggested based on date, amount, and any rules you've set up. We'll get to rules a bit later. All you need to do is approve the match. Approving gets them ready for reconciliation. If a match can't be found, you can find a transaction to match it to. Or, if it's yet to be recorded, you can add it from here. Most of the details are picked up from the bank info. Just select the account and record it. It's that easy. Done, approved and ready for reconciliation. To save you heaps of time, set up rules and use the bank info to create account right transactions. Rules are perfect for transactions that happen all the time, like fuel purchases or bank fees. A transaction is automatically recorded when you approve transactions with a rule applied. If you've been working with AccountRight for some time, there's something to watch out for. AccountRight won't find a match for bank transactions that have already been reconciled. So if you know an unmatched transaction has been entered and reconciled, it's important that you don't add it again. To remove it from your feed, right-click and hide it. While we're talking about bank reconciliations, you should do this to double-check that your books are OK. Even though bank feeds makes it easy to add and check your data, there's always a chance of human error. It's up to you how often you do this, but using bank feeds means most of the work is already done for you. You'll notice that all the transactions you've approved are already selected, so completing your bank rec should just be a click away. Neat, huh? And that's it. Start using bank feeds and see how much time you'll save. 